Hello everyone, Copyright Cup here. Today I'm going to be making an updated tutorial on how to import Lunar Client Profiles for Windows. I will also be making separate tutorials on both Mac and Linux in the near future for those of you who use those platforms. If you find this tutorial helpful, please consider liking and subscribing to the channel because it really helps me out and motivates me to make more of these technical tutorials. That's enough intro, let's get into it. So first, you need to go to the Lunar Assets folder. The fastest method to do this is by pressing the Windows and R key to open the Run dialog. So like that. And then in there you want to type dot lunar client and hit enter. Or you want to go under settings, game, and copy the profile you want to import into there. In this case I'll be doing my profile. I'll have it linked in the description below if you want to have it. Also very important step, you must remove it from a zip file if it's in one. File extensions like .rar and .7z are best opened with tools like 7zip or winrar. I personally prefer 7-zip and I'll have it listed in the description below. Now that we have the profile added, we need to register with Lunar. To do this, we need to close out of the Lunar Assets folder and launch Lunar Client. Once Lunar is loaded, we need to just close out of it. Um, this will create the files needed to fully register the profile. We need to go back into the Lunar Assets folder. As mentioned before, the fastest way to do so is by pressing the Windows and the R key to bring up the Run dialog. From last time, .LunarClient should still be saved in the search box, so we can just hit Enter to go to the Lunar Assets. Again, let's go under Settings and Game. And as you can see, there are JSON files that were created. And now we need to edit ProfileManager.json. You can use any text editing software you'd like. I'm going to be using Visual Studio Code to highlight the important stuff and make it easier to follow along. You want to highlight from the first curly bracket to the second one labeled default and copy it. Like so. Press Ctrl C to copy it or you can right click and click copy. And now you want to scroll all the way to the end of the list right here. Go to the last curly bracket right before the square bracket. Put a comma and paste in the contents from your clipboard. We need to change some things about this though. First we need to change where it says name from default to the exact name that you're importing. In this case it's going to be copyrighted cup. And under display name, as it suggests, is the name it will display in Lunar. You can change this to whatever you'd like. In my case, I'll be doing copyrighted cup. Last but not least, let's change the value of default to false. Don't forget to save and you're ready to close out of your editor and play Lunar with your new profile. That's all from me. If you found this tutorial helpful, please consider liking and subscribing to the channel. And if you need any help, I'll link my Discord down in the description below as well. Thanks for watching. Peace.